I get to go to San Juan, Puerto Rico, which is fun. I just feel like each time I fly, I learn something new, which is really good. I don't know. Welcome to my new world of I don't know what time it is and where I am. <laughs> but anyway. Yep, this is work. It's time for me to leave the beach. So anyway, so Mike picked me up. We went, no, no. Okay. Mike picked me up and we went to dinner and now I'm going back to get on my flight. Stay tuned because you get to see where I go tomorrow and it is another very cool destination. So Everybody and welcome to today's vlog. Sorry about for the light, Mike. Are you okay with that? Absolutely. All right. So good morning. I'm Jill, and I am a brand new Southwest flight attendant, Ooh. headed off to my very first flight. I had a training flight um, where before tr before training ended, before graduation. So I was on there sort of as an extra crew member. Now I am a full fledged crew member, and I am getting ready to go on my very first flight. So it's exciting, and I'm very nervous all at the same time. I'm going through everything. <laughs> my head like first I do this then I do this then I do this um, my first flight is quite a doozy it's a four hour flight and I get to go to San Juan Puerto Rico which is fun so I'm gonna head to Puerto Rico and um, spend the night that afternoon and the night there and then come back tomorrow and uh, back to the mainland of the United States and I'll share with you where I'm headed tomorrow so I'm pretty excited all of my classmates we have a group chat with my classmates and um, by the way, I just graduated on Friday, so if you guys haven't been watching, if you're new to the channel, I just graduated Southwest Flight Attendant Training on Friday, and um, this is a second new career for me, and uh, it's been quite the adventure, which I knew was gonna be on the outset, but it has totally been an adventure. Anyway, so we have a group chat with all my classmates, and there were 47 that graduated in my class, and we everybody is on their first flights yesterday and today, and everybody's just like, texting around it's so fun it's so nice to have the support of your classmates and sort of hear like how they're doing and where they're going and, and what's up so we're all supporting each other and Michael John of course has been supporting me and the kids and my parents so my friends so it's very exciting so stay tuned I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to film being a newbie like yeah um, on the plane and stuff but um, certainly when I get there I will let you know <laughs> so have a great day today fly Jilly fly here I go I love you hi sweetie Good Bye. luck. You're going to do great. <laughs> you look terrific. Thank you. Love you too. I'll stay in touch. All right. Bye. Love that girl. We're getting ready to go on. This is my friend Renee, and this is Carly. Yay! And Anthony's gonna be with us, and we have two puppies, of course. We just, well, we only met one so far, but we're just waiting to get on. Our flight is a little bit delayed, which is fine, but we all brought our bathing suits. We're all gonna go to the beach. Carly's been there before. Is it awesome? It's yes. Awesome. It's awesome. Oh, there's Anthony right there. He's cleaning, so we're gonna go in and help him clean. But in the meantime, <laughs> I'm very excited. Fantastic flight. We landed. I got up in the cockpit. There's Renee. <laughs> Renee and I are ready for our very first overnight in San Juan. Are you excited? Yes. Yes. What excited. do you What do you want to do? Go to the beach, lay out, relax. <laughs> I love it. We worked hard this morning. We deserve it, right? It was a great flight. It was a great flight. Thank you so much for doing on my first flight. Oh, it was awesome. I'm so excited. All right, so I have to call Mike and make sure that he knows that I landed. He, knowing him, though, he, my husband, he probably followed the flight the whole way in because he's just that kind of guy. <laughs> so I made it, Mike. It's all good. Hey everybody, so if you didn't know from the video where we are, and sorry I didn't get a lot on the plane, but that's, I'm not really allowed to, so I'm not allowed to film when there's passengers on the plane, so totally respect that, and I would not do that, um, but we flew to San Juan, Puerto Rico, so for my very first flight, my very first trip as a flight attendant, I get to go to San Juan crazy. It's like, I don't know how I got the luck of the draw, but I did. So we were delayed a couple of hours. Um, and I'm not exactly sure why, but so we were supposed to get here around one o'clock and I think it is now, let's see, it is 2.15. 
So actually, I think it's 3.15. Is that right, San Juan time? I don't know. Welcome to my new world of I don't know what time it is and where I am. <laughs> but anyway, thrilled to be here. Um, our crew is great and we are staying in a very cool hotel and I will give you a room tour. All right, this is the entrance. My closet's right here. And you come along and I have a desk and a refrigerator if you guys wanna see what I brought. So I brought food with me because we do have to buy our own food. So I do have some breakfast and some snacks. There's some chicken salad, hard boiled eggs. This is hard boiled eggs with dark chocolate almonds and cheese. And then this is green juice, some yogurt, some water, and that's creamer for my coffee. And that is my lunchbox getting frozen again. There's some, some water. So that's my refrigerator with some of my snacks. And we have coffee service and all that stuff right here. A balcony. I am not overlooking the beach, but I am overlooking San Juan. <laughs> nice balcony, there's my bed, side tables, everything you could ever want in a hotel. I'll be here for about 15 hours. So this is my uh, bathroom and my shower. And so that's the hotel room tour. So there is a pretty nice pool here. So I'm gonna meet the crew. We're gonna have some lunch and then um, go, I think, hang out at the pool and catch some sun and maybe take a nap because it was an early morning this morning. Not as early as training, but it was an earlier morning this morning. So I texted Mike, let him know I'm here and um, I'll send a picture to the kids once I'm out in the pool because <laughs> I think they'll love to see that. So the flight was great. I loved it. The passengers were excellent. The crew was great. The um, it was a nice long flight, so I got I had a lot of time to do service, which was really nice for the, um, the drink service. And I was in a seat position, so I was up front with A, with Anthony, and it was great. And then I went back and chit-chatted a bit and got to know uh, Renee and then Carly as well, so really fun. And the pilots, they let me up into the cockpit. Did I already tell you that? Oh my gosh, I got a picture up there and I got a quick video. So I um, will put that in so you guys can see what I did when I was on, the, on my trip. So I'm absolutely loving it. Um, we're here, so just one leg today and then tomorrow we have three legs and then three legs the last day as well. So back from Puerto Rico and I will let you know tomorrow where I am tomorrow night. All right, quick change. I brought a easy, an easy peasy dress. I have my bathing suit on under here. I have my sunglasses. I have a little um, thing to carry like all my junk and we're gonna go down. I think we're gonna have some lunch and then hang out at the pool. See you later. Hey right, guys, I met my crewmates and we made it out. That's the pool. We just walked past it, but now we're gonna go to the beach. Look how beautiful it is. Oh my gosh. It's a little windy out. There's a red flag warning, by the way. Did you see that? There's a red flag right there. It's good? We're okay? There's no lifeguards, so that's why it's red. I see. Okay, okay, okay. Look at how beautiful. Yep, this is work. You guys can be South Class flight attendants. Just saying. Although I know every day is not going to be this good. <laughs> so guys, we'll land in cold and rainy weather, and that's okay too. <laughs> I hope it's not too windy for you to hear me. Um, I spent some time at the pool with my crewmates and then decided to come out and go into the water because you have to go into the water when you're in San Juan. And I did and now I'm just sitting here on the chair relaxing while the sun goes down. So this is the thing, it's six o'clock and the guy just came by and told me it's chairs gotta go back. So it's time for me to leave the beach. But it was a wonderful day so far. I think I'm gonna go have some din, -din and um, settle in for the night. Hey you guys, I am gonna call it a night. I am in bed and ready to go to sleep and it is only 8.30 at night, but I do have to wake up at 4 a.m. I have a 5.10 van call in the morning to go to the airport and fly three legs tomorrow, which I'm very excited about. 
Um, I just feel like each time I fly, I learn something new, which is really good. I was so, so nervous to fly this morning that I did not sleep at all last night. I was like tossing and turning, so I got no sleep, so I'm definitely exhausted. But um, as nervous as I was, like I was really nervous. <laughs> um, I, Because I was nervous, you know what I was nervous about? I was nervous that I was gonna forget something or not wake up or um, not do it right. It's my, you know, I'm the, this is the first time I flew by myself. So I was like, oh my gosh, but I had the best crew and it was awesome. And I absolutely loved it. And I cannot wait to go out there tomorrow again and meet passengers and serve passengers and, and do it all over again. I'm so excited. So what was originally very nervous, nerving, nerving, is that a right word? Turned into something very awesome and I'm just excited so it went from nerves to excited so I cannot wait for tomorrow so you guys thank you so much for following me on my journey today on my very first flight by myself and to a very cool destination and like I said um stay tuned because you get to see where I go tomorrow and it is another very cool destination so thank you guys so much for watching comment down below what made you guys happy today what made me happy was definitely having a great great flight and looking forward to it again tomorrow so um hope you guys are doing well we'll stay tuned for tomorrow and have a great night good morning everybody from pensacola florida this is day number three of my first three-day trip as a flight attendant with southwest airlines and it is right now 5.45 in the morning and I'm getting ready to go down to the lobby and meet my crew to go on our last flight. Today we are going from Pensacola, Florida to Nashville, Tennessee, and then to Norfolk, Virginia, and then to Baltimore, Maryland. So, so far my trip has been amazing. I don't know how I lucked out and got this first trip to San Juan, Puerto Rico and Pensacola, Florida, two beach towns. They must know I love the beach. Anyway, um, it, I, it's been such a great learning experience too. I'm totally enjoying it and I'm not nervous anymore to go on the plane. <laughs> Thank goodness, because the first day I was super, super nervous, but I'm actually very excited to go on the plane and um, do my do my work and meet the passengers and work with my crew. I'm very excited. So, and tonight, hopefully, if we get back in time, I can get on a commuter flight and take it from Baltimore back down to Florida and see Ryan. Looks like Mike's gonna stay in Maryland. He's got some work to do in Connecticut. So he's doing that and then we'll, I'll go back to Florida and then he'll come back uh, a couple days later. So um, everybody's been so amazing. So stay tuned. I hope I can film. I won't be able to film on the plane when there's passengers, but hopefully I'll get a little bit of film for you today. I don't think we get off the plane though, so there really won't be much to see in all those different cities until we get to Baltimore. All right, see you guys. All right, you guys, we landed in Nashville. Take a look out there. It's a little bit cold and rainy, um, but we're just doing a turn here. So we're here for a little bit of time, maybe like half an hour, and we turn around and then pick up more passengers and head on to Norfolk. Hey, there's Chili. There she is. <laughs> Hi there. Congratulations. Congratulations. Here's my first trip. Thank you. <laughs> How are you? So proud of you. Oh my gosh. You look so professional. Do I look real? Yeah. <laughs> it was great. I had such a great time. It was like, it was so fun to do. And I, it's especially fun because now I know what I'm doing. You know what I mean? Yeah. Great crew, great like destinations. Yeah. Great passengers, great, great passengers. Oh, good. So fun. So I can always tell you all about it. I want to hear. Awesome. Yes, thank you. Are we going up? Uh, we're going back the other way. Oh. Let's go. Let's do it. Okay, it's 7.02 and Mike and I are headed back to the airport. So Mike picked me up as you saw from the airport and I had, what time did I land? Like three, right? Three, four, five. I had like four hours in between when I landed and when I'm gonna take my com commuter flight home. So commuter flight, basically my base is Baltimore. So any of my flights that I work end up back in Baltimore and then I get on another flight and fly back to Florida. Um, or I could stay in Baltimore because like if I was gonna stay here, but Ryan's back in Florida, so I'm gonna go back and be with Ryan. Oh, thank you. So anyway, so Mike picked me up. We went, no, no, 
There we go. Mike picked me up and we went to dinner. And now I'm going back to get on my flight to head back to Florida. And I will be, I'm supposed to land at like 11.30 tonight. And then I will get to see Ryan in the morning and until I leave again, which I think is Wednesday. Ooh. Yes, yes, so that's how that's how this week is going. I'm pretty sure that's how most of the weeks will go, except for this trip that I just had are on different days than I don't normally have, I think, so I know. So stay tuned, I'm gonna fly back and Thanks for everything, Mike. We had a great dinner. Yeah, it was awesome. awesome. Thanks so much for following my journey. This has been such a new thing for me, and I encourage each and every one of you to follow your dreams. Even if you're nervous, even if you're excited, just go for it. You never know what might become of it. Thanks for watching, guys. See you tomorrow.